attitude to New Year's resolutions is a bit like Sam Goldwyn's view of verbal contracts. They're not worth the paper they're written on. Of course, most resolutions never even get written down in the first place, so it's no surprise they disappear into the ether by mid-January. But some things are worth writing down, and one of them is your wealth plan. One of the few bright things that George W. Bush ever said was, if you're not following your own agenda, you must be following someone else's. Which, in this age of uncertainty, could prove to be very dangerous. Do you really want your family's financial future to be at the beck and call of Boris Johnson or Joe Biden, the Bank of England or the Federal Reserve? The only answer is to further your financial education form a view of the big picture, and then document your investment strategy based on that. Is the booming stock market going to continue the longest bull market in history? Will we end up with negative interest rates? Are we heading for inflation or deflation? And do you have assets that will perform for you in either scenario? Are you taking part in the crypto boom, or is it passing you by? Will the mini boom in the property market continue or fizzle out in 2021? I will shortly be launching the Renegade Investor Revolution to help people address these issues, and you can join the priority waiting list at renegadeinvestoracademy.com. Whether you want to further your financial education with me or not, please take the time to document your 2021 wealth plan so that you are working to your own agenda, rather than being at the whim of politicians and central banks.